Hey everyone, it's Diablo 12. Welcome back to part. I want to say part nine. Yeah, part nine of the tutorials. And like I said in the last one, I'm going to make a image of what our profile will look like. So yes, I made my image. Isn't it pretty? Okay. So I'm just gonna explain it to you. So right here on the uh, top right corner, I wanted to say welcome, like welcome your username, so welcome Andrew Wren, and then you'll be able to click Andrew Wren, which will take you to the profile, and the welcome Andrew Wren will be on every page, not just the profile page. So we are going to be doing a little CSS, but like I said, I'm not good at it, so not a lot of it. Um, and then I just wrote profile here, so we knew what it was. Um, I haven't I haven't decided on what to put on the top yet. This is gonna be like our this is gonna be like included on every page we do. Um, but yeah. So on the left here you can see we have it says the username, that'll be in a legend, so it'll look, you know, like yeah. And then we have message, so like send a message, you know. And then here you have add friend, so you can add him as a friend, which we will add later. And then in the middle, I added signature, and I put that on the top in description, like, you know, a profile, like, about them and stuff, you know, so, and I put that down here. So we have the signature on top and the description on bottom. And the signature can be included in the forum post, too. That's what I plan to do. And then on the here on the right side, we'll have info, posts, last scene, you know, like, when was the last time they were on, and etc. So whenever we think of something else to add, oh, and guild, too, you know, so guild. Um, we'll, we'll be able to add all of those, hopefully. Um, like, they can add info about themselves. Well, not about them, like, um, like, where they live, what time zone they are, you know, all stuff like that. Um, and then posts, you know, how many posts they have on the forum last time they were on. So, we'll have to be, I'll, I'm going to get some custom scripting from some, well, not from someone, but from a website, because I don't really know the code for it, but I know how it works kind of you know so we're gonna do that and guild we're gonna make guild later and but we'll add it in now just to save time not save time but you know yeah so I'm, I'm just gonna save this as profile and I'm just gonna exit this and here we have PHP designer and I already had a user.php open but that was my old one and I was just taking a look because I'm not good at CSS at all so I just want to take a look, but, you know, I'm going to open um, includes.php, and this is where we're going to do our um, our styling. So we're just going to do a ref equal, no, that's not right, um, script type equals, nope, it's, I don't even remember, it's, not script style style type text slash CSS yeah um so we're gonna do we're gonna just start out completely on our profile and we're gonna do actually this is gonna be for all um font style will be nope font type I think uh, font family serif. I'm just gonna re come here and refresh just to see what that doesn't do anything. Um, see, I'm not gonna peach or CSS. I'm just gonna do font family and then I'm gonna do Tahoma. I don't think that'll do anything. There we go, Tahoma. Perfect. Okay, so now everywhere we go, the font style is Tahoma. So if we go to log out, it would be Tahoma. Um, I'm going to do font size, and I'm going to make that 9 pixels. Oh, too small. Uh, I'm going to make it 11. And you know what? Okay, I'm going to make it 12. <laughs> and you know in some places, um, you can change it, like, like where I have the legend at, I'm going to have that bigger, be bigger, and you know, yeah. So... Oh, and also, I looked, uh, click here to log out. You've been log. I, see, I don't want that to show up if you're, 
showing. So I'm going back to the index.php and else if logged in and I mean not logged in and and act equals there we go now it shouldn't show perfect now I'm gonna log in again perfect 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 okay so now that you've seen all the text is the same too um, what else can we do we can I'm gonna do um, legend I think Uh, legend will be font size 14 pixels and I'm just gonna come to the index because I'm sorry I'm not good so I'm just gonna come over here and I'm gonna make a legend legend test slash legend I didn't do anything see okay well, let me put it in a field set Set. Ah, uh, I can't tell. I'll change the font size to be even bigger, just so I can see. Okay, yeah. So it does show. Watch, I'll change it big. See, now it does show how big it is. So now I'm just gonna set. I'm just gonna create our. Um. Like I said, our um, user.php page, um, PHP, and I am going to incorporate it on the index page. I've decided. Um, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah. Um. Uh. Echo. Hello. Oops. I need to save that as user.php. And then go back to your index. And like always, we're going to do if act equals user. Act. Act equals user. Okay, so if act equals user. And then in here, it does not show hello. Oh, yeah. Uh, include once inc slash user dot php just like that save it always and it says hello perfect okay so now in user dot php we're going to do if we well uh, in back in index we're going to do if act equals user and we're going to do two ampersands and and action oops, action equals um, ID so if there's no ID oh actually we need to not have that <laughs> okay uh, just so just take that out I'm sorry what I just put in just take that out uh, save it and go back to user.php and I'm going to erase and action equals ID. I'm going to, in user.php, I'm going to say if uh, get um, ID, then echo we have an ID, else echo you have not sp specified an ID and then exit so we're just gonna refresh and now if I do um, and ID equals three perfect okay comment uh, rate subscribe love you